morning guys. Welcome to the Werribee Gorge State Park, which I've worked out this morning. There's nowhere near Werribee. It's actually at um, Bacchus Marsh or at the back of Bacchus Marsh. So anyway, I had been looking this morning at um, what the main um, Werribee Gorge walk was, but given us down near the river, we're on the 1st of July at the moment and it's um, been raining for the last two days. So I thought I'll do this one. This one looks a bit more elevated, so not near the river. Um, it's only a short one, two hours, I think a two hour walk. So we're going a bit of a Captain Cook through the bush here. Brought the camera, see if we can take some photos of something, some wildlife if there's any about. It doesn't look too bad a park, but quite easy to get to from where I am in Sunbury. Anyway, we'll go for a bit of a wander and have a bit of a look oh, around. Gosh. There's a bit of downhill. So when you've got downhill, it means you've got to come back uphill. It's a part of that like. A reasonably heavy backpack on because I'm carrying the, the camera, the tripod, and the drone, so um, but we'll have a nice slow day. Hopefully, they don't fall us overhead. It's very nice through here, isn't it? to say about the middle of winter here in the Australian bush it's just the air is just fresh and clean and outstanding I don't think I'd be walking through here in the middle of summer um, I think that'd be a place best avoided not only because of snakes but I think if you got down this hill and a fire come through it would be pretty much rat shit <laughs> As you see, I'm taking my time here because everything's a bit slippery and I'm a bit clumsy and I'll end up falling ass overhead so the track goes up this way. So my uh, heavy breathing is starting to come through on the microphone. I suspect what a, a two hour walk for most people. The pace I'm going today is going to take me about four anyway carrying plenty of food and water. But this is pretty spectacular. So we're getting pretty high now, not sure how much further there is, I wouldn't expect us too far, but certainly the air is much cooler. Just being a little bit cautious of this loose rock and the feet. The trail's flattened out here a little bit, which is pretty easy walking. Starting to catch my breath a little more. I think this is, for most people, this is a pretty simple walk. Um, nothing too treacherous or hard about it, so I think most people could do this one. Not sure how far I've got to go, I'm going very slow, but I suspect it's not that far to go. This must be our 
fork out ahead. Falcons look out. Emergency marker. Victorian Climbing Club. The belay posts and fences have been installed. Okay, so the climbers use this here a bit, do they? I don't like heights. No wind today. Like the drain out over there. Okay, this is impressive. Serious business. It's a pretty wild view. Very spectacular. So Marky doesn't like heights. So Marky's not getting too close to the edge. Look at the camera. That's pretty spectacular. I think that's worth a walk. So I suspect. The little river down there is likely the Werribee River. Possibly. Oh god, I hate seeing any heights. I can't believe these blokes do it. Yeah. So for me, this is as close as I get to the edge of any sort of height. I can't stand heights. It just makes me feel ill. And this is not making me feel good. Yeah, so I've been up here about an hour, um, starting to get a bit dark again, so I'll head back down. Got some, hopefully some good drone footage, just out through there, down through the gorge and sort of followed the river along, so hopefully that turns all right. Haven't seen our abseils, I did catch a video, video of them with the drone, but I think they've gone further down the, the cliff face here. But um, anyway, it's been a worthwhile walk, um, something quite different. Yeah, Werribee Gorge, nowhere near Werribee. Who would have thought? Anyway, so wander back down, we'll catch you some. See what we can see on the way down.
Okay. This is the bit I was dreading. This is the up bit towards the car park. Oh, okay, for a, an old bloke that's out of condition, made it up the hill, a bit of puffing and panting and a few stops, but uh, we got here anyway. That's Ironbark Gorge track and Falcon's Lookout. I just had to check it on the sign. Um, yeah, bit of fun. Bit of fun. Good day to do it because it's nice and cool. My glasses are fogging up, sweating, but all good. Um, catch you on the next video. Cheers, guys.